Pau Sharabanki Tamalta for Miss City, my father. Welcome to another episode from the Macedon Rangers and District Motor Club. This truck here, my brother Bernard Camilleri and myself, Charlie Camilleri, are part owners of this. Uh, Bernard has put in all the ideas and basically all the effort and work into doing it. It's Maltese style. Like the old Maltese buses are set up like this and the old Thames trucks are all set up like this or the Dodgers in Malta. Now everything on the truck is basically set up for Maltese style. It's a 1950 Thames truck sitting on an F350 chassis. It's been fully engineered. It has a 351 Windsor in it. Now it's on club plates. We thought it's, you know, we'll go down the club plates situation. The colours my brother absolutely loves, so he said he's gonna go for these colours. Now facing the front, obviously everything is set up how a Maltese bus will be. These are these are all the badges. And over here, this badge here was from a family friend from his actual bus. How did you get such, you know, th these my, are rare, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, my brother got that when he was in Malta probably 15 years ago. The Maltese Trotter, that's how they put it on their buses over there. But basically, as we walk around the truck, this is a mountain in Halea in my father's village. This is set up like so a family Malta. How, how do you say that? Oh, geez, that's pretty hard. That Monte Arbor, that's the, the mountain in my dad's village. Now, the village that my father's from is from Halea. Our family name is Camilleri, but in Malta they have nicknames. And the family nickname for my father was Taliyo'o, which is on the doors and at, at, the, the, back. at the back. Yep. Now, these signatures, that's BC, that's Bernard Camilleri, that's who my brother, my brother did the truck, yep. and he's basically set it up with his uh, name on it, proud owner of it, and I use it, I share yep. the passion with him. Basically, yep. it's our family passion that we don't want to lose, and we love the truck. Absolutely. Now, you'll see the on this side, Kate, and the other side is Zane, they're his grandkids. Yes. As we walk around the truck, so at the back of the truck. Oh, hang on. In what's, Maltese, all, what's, yeah? what's all this? What that is, is uh, they're all family and friends that have passed away. Lovely. And yeah. It's so that's the, the last one there's uh, Tom Misiri, Ilio, oh, that's my father. He passed away in uh, the 17th of the 6th, 2020, just as the truck was made. Mm, lovely. So, the back here is in memory of friends and family. Yes. And over here, as we walk around the back, that's getting back to Taliotu's the family name. You're saying this is a, a, a nickname, is yeah, it? Yeah, that's the nickname from the family. Every village in Malta, every person, like from, I say, the old school people, they all, all the families had a nickname. Yes. So that was our family nickname. So whether yeah. your kids, grandkids or not, they'll say, oh, yeah, he was from Taliotl. They'll know that he was from that family. And yes. that's how the Maltese are recognised in such a small country. Okay. So yes. as we move around the truck, basically, I mean, I know it's yeah. something it's... simple like petrol, but that's how the Maltese did in petrol. They didn't call it in Maltese. Um, in Maltese it's a different name but keeping up with my brother want to keep the tradition of how the Maltese style or Maltese yes. buses are set up that's how it's set up who did your sign writing uh, my brother's friend Brilliant. did the sign writing yes. a fantastic job you're going to show us something here yep that, so that that's getting back to the the family name yes and then basically inside it we tried to keep it a, a bridge. Look, looking as original as we can and trying to keep it basic as we can that's my father up there yes and basically inside with the rosary with everything hanging up that's like the old school buses and trucks that's how we had them 
Beautiful. That's how basically the Maltese style had them. What sort of um, transmission do we have in it? No, that's a four speed out of an F truck. So it's got the F truck box and F truck chassis. F, F truck. Yeah, F350 uh, chassis to so, keep up, like I mean. So underneath. Yep, that's sitting on an F350 chassis. Really? Yeah, because my brother, he didn't want any dramas with engineers, so he said we've got to put a so, V8 in it. And he picked the F351 Windsor. Yes. He wanted a Cleveland, but it wouldn't fit because it, there's no room because of the sides. Yes. So the Windsor was his choice and a good choice. It sits in the engine bay nice. Do you want to see yeah, the engine now? Absolutely. Okay. Yes. Any modifications with the firewall? No, is, what, everything, what, what we're seeing here is... No, a, Everything under here, apart from the motor and obviously radiator, is all original. That's why we wanted to keep it like that. And so, yeah, they did it how the tags would be, and that's what we've kept. And then we've we've got the that's the chassis number there. So, this here, yeah, that's the chassis number. Yes. And what we've done is. We've kept everything under the engine bay, try and keep it original as possible. It's a treat. It looks really, really, really well done. See, like my brother tried for the Cleveland, but the Cleveland just won't fit. This just fits in there. Yeah, like, how do you, how do, how do you surface it? Is it well, easy? to do the spark plugs, these sides have to come off. Really? Yeah, they all have to come off because you can't get in there. There's just no room. How do you get the, when you say the sides? Yeah, these all come off. This, yeah. this, no, side, this, these this. sides here come off from inside. Wow. You take off the, the little trim. Then you can get to it. You have to get into it from there. You can't get into it any other way. Wow. Mm. So that's basically it. Lovely. Power steer. So the power steering is F. 350? Yes, everything is F350. In Malta, yeah. every person... Yeah, I know they've got a nickname. My, so my, my nana's Zabuk, because yeah. she's from there. Yeah, Zabuk, right? yeah, so from... all the kids used to throw yeah. olives out. See, Zabuk is olives. So your Maltese or origins Maltese? My parents both Maltese, but our origins go back 400 years to Italy. Wow. My, our surname anyway, dad's yes. surname. My uncle was um, from Kershaw. Yep, yep, which yep. is like uh, fried or fish John. Yes. He just came back from there. Yeah, he just came really? back. From Malta? Yeah, he just came back from, yeah, yeah, from Mamp. What you just said now, he just came back from that village in so, Gozo's. Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He knew so everything I'm going about in, this. I'm going in May. You're going in May, eh? Yeah. Beautiful. To Italy or to but Malta? I'm going... In May, we're going to Malta and in Gozo. Beautiful. Because my birthday falls while I'm there, so I celebrate my rallies. Yes. Then we're flying back to... Venice, start Beautiful. Venice, Belgium, uh, sorry, Venice, Munich, up further in Germany, I can't remember. Well, oh, what a lovely trip mine, that'll be. Mine's yes. gone blank. Uh, Munich, where are we going after Munich? Further up. So, this is wants to see the Brandenburg Gates, yeah? Yes. So, we're going up that way, wherever that is. And then across Ber the Not Amsterdam. into Berlin or? Yeah, probably Berlin, you're right. Yeah, Berlin, and then... Across to Amsterdam, Brussels, yeah. Paris, then from Paris we're flying to Milan to go to Como. Because well, to yes. do it by bus and train is going to take like two and a half days. So yeah, 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 yeah. How so? How long's that trip for, Lou? Nearly six weeks. Good beautiful. On you, beautiful. What were you saying about nicknames? So actually, so my dad's nickname, right, was the family nickname was El Cachetón, meaning mm. the hunters. Yeah. Right. Yep. And my mother's nickname, my mother's family's nickname, is called Tajuk. But what happens when your mama and you take your, your father's nickname? You, okay. Yeah. So you, um, yeah, well that happens with marriage, doesn't <laughs> yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Everyone has, like old school, has a family nickname, yeah. and everyone will know. Oh, hang on, yeah, he's from Takachito. Yeah, well, he's yep. from Toyoto. Yeah. Everyone over there, even the policeman knows, oh, hang on, that's that family name. Even yeah. they have that. And then the nickname goes further. They know that nickname comes from that village. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So my my grandfather's nickname came from St. Julian's, 
Yeah. And my mum's nickname came from a small, the small island Gozo and came from Shara. Yeah. <laughs> Funny stuff. Yeah. Funny stuff. The significance of the naming and all oh, your yeah. nicknames and all that sort of stuff. It goes back generations. Yeah. Look, my, my grandmother's nickname and my dad, and my, so the Jup is my grandfather, his wife was Tabringila, which is an eggplant. Okay. Yeah. Because of what, they grow eggplant? Could have been. <laughs> no, it, is, it, it could be for me. Like, like the other guy was saying, Lou, his is the olive. Tubs up bulge. Yeah. Tubs up yeah. yeah. Really? It, it could yeah. be from there. There's an actual village, Zabulji Mold. That's where yeah. I stayed. When I was, um, I stayed three weeks in Zabulji. Yeah, see, that's the olive. <laughs> yeah. An olive in uh, Zabulji means olive, olive and mm. Lou's family name is the olive Zabulji. But yeah. they might not even come from Zabulji, but they can come from Zabulji. Yeah. Wow. That's how it goes, go back, yeah, yeah. Yes. And is that still present today? Yes, yes. three weeks ago. Oh, three, uh, so you were, ago, you right? felt like you were back back in the old oh, world. It was beautiful. Yeah? yeah, very slow, very quiet. <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. So Aussie or Australia is quite fast. Oh, very fast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. yeah. You, you, you got to like it was a time war, and they were complaining that it's speeding up on them. Well, it's happening. We're getting faster here. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, I, um, I got some videos of the hill climb of Chara in oh, photos. Okay. I went to the home village where my mum comes from. When I was there 34 years ago, my grandfather was racing his horse up the hill, and now it's turned into a hill climb circuit. So, so you still got race horses in Malta? No, oh, they still have my family. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Funny. Oh, it's a different world. Though. Oh, yeah, lovely. I, I must admit I enjoyed it. Did you see any old buses there? I've seen a couple. They, they were using um, the trucks. There was a couple of old trucks getting around. But the old buses now were getting set up as wedding Did, for weddings. Yeah, I know. And yeah, they're, they're using them for, for tours what, and the, weddings, yeah. To take the guests around in yeah, the bus? Yeah, yeah, Because if you see what killed me, the streets are really narrow. Then they park oh, yeah. on the streets. And then a, a, a standard bus we have now is going down the street as well. It's, right. uh, it's not made for it, mate. It's no. Not made. It was designed for a horse and car. My, yes. This village here where my father's from, uh, Halia, the village was designed, like um, John was saying, for horse and car. car yeah. And, mate, they park a car, you can't even get another car through. <laughs> no. It's just like it's, this it's, elaborate one. And I had a Ford Focus uh, rental, the six speed, did not get out of third gear. Second, third. Gear. Here's another Cumbulary. What's your family nickname? He wants to know family nicknames. Marty. He doesn't know how to talk Maltese, no, look at him. No, no. Talk. All right, well, you're going to video it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, hang on, what are you sitting in here? Yeah, Chantal Malalnek. It's in Fujiji, the truck tier. Oh, Peter. What I said you. A family name, Tiak. Shinny. Tamati. Mishiri Tamati. The home is in Tangarbali. Oenti Kamaleri. Oenti Kamaleri, yeah. My Malapali. Your Malapali? <laughs> Means like me in Maltese, he's a Kamaleri yeah. like me. Yeah. Cool. So what do you reckon of the track? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Hey? Eh?